important for me. So I, we do deck text when we like show our hands. Is that? Yeah, you can talk through it right now. I've got your deck pulled up, James. Uh, how did your roto draft go? So my roto draft was okay. Um, I think the the big issue that I ran into was I wanted to I took an Arcbound Ravager pick one with the hopes that it would kind of scare people off off of certain kinds of like payoffs or synergies and it did not at all. Um, they immediately nobody just got, said I'm going to take got a bite a of your apple. I like what it is you're eating. Um, so I had to figure out how to pivot. So I took a couple of powerful white cards and then it kind of broke out that like the two people that were drafting. There's three people that were drafting red. One of them wound up being four color. Another one wound up being three color. So red actually had a bunch of like its aggressive stuff untouched relatively. So I moved into that and kind of um, created a little Boros Madness package. So I've got things like Guardian of New Banalia, um, as well as a bunch of like, you know, Faithless Lootings and Voldar and Epicure making blood tokens to discard a bunch of Madness cards. And I'm hoping it'll let me be aggressive without going down on cards. And I'm going to go ahead and keep this hand... Um, I mulliganed. I, I mulliganed the hand of no lands. All right, and then uh, Max, while you're drawing your hand, talk us through how your draft went. My draft was awkward. I wanted to be KCI. Um, <laughs> and put you and everyone else wanted and to be KCI. Everyone else wanted to be KCI. Uh, so I mostly just have Mox Opal, really. Um, but yeah, but it, it ended up being fine. I was able to quickly pivot into the white aggro cards, and they were very open at the time. And yeah, there's a couple of things I missed out of it, but it's like a pretty good like version of the white aggro deck. Yeah. Pretty All right. Well, how's that hand? This is your this is your six. This is my six. So you already rolled for this. Yeah, I'm going first. Uh, so this is my six. I'm just it's a pretty clean send this back, and the sand is all right. So I hope the frame drops stop. I don't know how to, I don't know how to affect that. You apply, tried applying glue to the frames. I, I mean, All right, you ready? I don't yeah. know why they dropped. Uh, I won the die roll. <laughs> My hand's worse now. That's for Sentinel. <laughs> <laughs> Is it a lot worse now? <laughs> oh yeah, oh, that's my favorite. Yeah, tapped and attacking Boma Curry. Yes to you. Um. Hello there. I'm Siri. Hi Siri. Siri. Hi Siri. I'm not interested in speaking to you. Uh, I'm gonna attack for one. Take one. I'm gonna play Spirit Eleventh. Here you go. Okay, that's kind of rude. Um, You're allowed to cast phases leading into it. Hey Junebug, thanks for the follow. Thank you for allowing me to do that. I appreciate that. It does not stop it. Olson, the uh, the cube map gets updated whenever we get around to it. It is not predictable. For a long time, the exports from Cube Cobra were also irregular. I'm not sure if that is still the case. Eater Virtue equipped to the... Esper Sentinel? Yeah, you got it. Cool. Equipped to the Bomat Courier? Yeah. Coming on in. Trigger. Take, Take three. three. Pass to you. James, not scared. Never scared. Never scared. Never say scared, because then they'll know. Combat attack for four. Take four. Just, just no blocks the game. <laughs> Uh, play a Night Scythe, make a 2-2. Two -two. Here you go. Okay. You want to rotate that mic towards you a little bit, James? Is that better? Yeah, I think so. Okay. Draw. Oh. Can I read Spirit of the Labyrinth? Yeah. That's a very good card against me. Yeah. Extremely rude. More than one card each turn. Yeah. So, includes your draw step. Yeah, I think Spirit of the Labyrinth was the card I went most from like, and eh, not being excited about it to then like when I was when I was looking at other people's decks list, I'm like, no, there's a couple of people this like really shuts off. I'll fire your temper, Spirit of the Labyrinth. Yeah, Percentual. you draw a card. Draw your card, you Draw your last pathetic <laughs> Draw two cards off of... I'll attack with Bowmat Courier. Oh, block. Yeah. This now will give anything it equipped to haste. Yeah. I'm just going to remember... Pretty cool. Gets exiled. Yep. Fine. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Cool. Fast you. That's pretty cool, James. I like that. Uh, yeah, that is pretty good. Um... Lanes, play 
Blade Splicer. Ah. <laughs> Isn't it cool when all of his cards make two creatures? <laughs> uh, get in the copter. It's attack. the first strike. Is, attack for four. Yeah, take four. Uh, play signal pass, Diego. All right. Were you not at 15? I had you at 15, I think. I don't know how. I don't know. Oh, I got you. I'll, I'll make. I'll match whatever you got down there. Maybe someone in chat was paying more attention. Or that maybe we messed up. It's part of the strategy of... It's I don't know. I'm not going to worry about it. Yeah, don't worry about it. Don't you dare worry about it. Don't worry about a thing. I feel like I just need... That doesn't do anything because... What's up, Blunt Lord ACAB? Happy Sunday. Oh, Blunt Lord ACAB back. <laughs> All right. All right, I'm gonna shock this in because yes. no fear here. Um, bitter reunion, discarding Anya's Ravager. All right, I'll draw a card. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my goodness gracious, that's percent is a problem. <laughs> one mana, one two. one. Draw three. All right, let's go to the next one. Yeah. All right, at least I got good sideboard cards. Oh no, I don't like to hear that. That was definitely a rough one. Yes. Drawing three cards off Esper Sentinel and then. Having to uh, full full retail runs. your uh, fiery yeah. temper is not where you want to be yeah. getting with that deck. I, I mean, my uh, hand was wait, really. Did good. you have bitter reunion? In the ha- did you have bitter reunion in the hand for fiery temper? Does that work? Yes, because you okay. because That's you discard first, and there no no it doesn't work it doesn't work right. But can I see bitter reunion? Uh, I will pull up because if, if it was here. tormenting voice, oh, wait, that's not bitter. Yeah, if, if it was tormenting voice, it would work because discarding is part of the one cost. Of I think bitter bitter reunion is uh, an ETB, so I think it's all his one ability. Yeah, so the draw yeah. resolves before the draw resolves before to... before the madness happens. Okay, good to know. But yeah, if it was something like uh, this card, uh, tormenting voice, that one would work. I can so. add the sideboard here for James. I don't even remember what James's cards are. Okay, I think. The sideboard is known information. So he's got an Arcbound Ravager, a Dark Confidant, Wear Tear, Duragar, Hedmage, Hedge Mage, Mia, Crafty Companion, and the Surly Badger. So are all in the sideboard the as Mage, options to bring in. It destroys enchantments if you have planes and artifacts if you have mount- mountains. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Cool. All right. I know. I love those cards. I love. So I'm ready to show my sideboard cards. Go for it. All right. So I'm taking uh, these out. Uh, the main reason being that. Um, oh, no. I'm already. This is already. I think the going to come out, and that makes this card a lot worse. And then if I'm already, and I think this just underperforms in general. Um, so I'm bringing in these cards, which I, I think should all hopefully be uh, pretty good to okay. Um, yeah. That is definitely not Patrick Deerl. Patrick is sober. He's also upstairs. And also upstairs. So definitely <laughs> not in chat. Max, any sideboard? Uh, I'm going to look at this card and then not side it. And then not side it in. That was really what it was. Got to look at it to know, though. Look at the card. Dude, okay. I know you. I, I, James, do you play Magic Online? Not really. Okay, one of my favorite things that Magic Online will do is there'll be effects that, like, you know, do something, and they'll just there'll just be a prompt that shows you some cards that says, look at the cards. And that's it. And then you say, like, all right, I've looked at the cards, and then it goes away. It's really... It's, it's Would you like to my, cut? No, you're good. It is definitely... I have a lot of motor quirks that I love, and then look at the cards is a pretty good one. Don't stop looking. There'll be just something like something like a Genesis wave or you're whatever, where you're just like, your opponent, because it's a reveal, you're, it'll just like look at the cards. Okay, I think I'm going to mulligan this. It's pretty simple. I don't think I can... I've goldfished with this deck a fair amount i just don't think i can keep Ooh. uh hands without uh red mana so i'm also mulliganing because i have two colorless lands it would have potentially been an okay hand but not with colorless lands not, not both going down to six which i think is fine well yeah you both had to I mean, <laughs> we are abiding by the rules of the games as written wow i don't Kaleido eyes. Thank for the follow. Thank for the follow. Thank for follow. <laughs> Thank, for Thank follow. press follow button. 
The crown is okay. for the current champion. So Max won the last round yeah. and is the reigning champ on stream. I'm going to keep this yeah. in hand. That doesn't actually mean I'm necessarily the person with the best record because there are people upstairs. Although we've only played one round, so it's all equal. And I think I'm going to be putting this back. Um, yeah. I'm assuming you're on the play. Yes. Maybe that should be on my list. All right, cool. Maybe that's incorrect. I don't um, know. Actually, sorry. I'm going to do this instead. This goes on the bottom. Cool. Um, I'm going to show off my hand, which I am keeping, but I am not sure what I'm putting back. I think I'm putting back one of these. But I think it's just I think I'm actually just putting this back. Yeah. Okay. So this goes. James on. is the owner of this cube and designer of this cube. Yeah. Owner, designer, lover, hater. <laughs> <laughs> I'm all the things. All, all right, are we ready? Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna go to eighteen. About my career. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, this this feels very similar. I'm gonna play an extra sentinel. <laughs> Here we go. The awkward part is uh, I, I'm not on the play this time. That will make a difference, but if you still get to draw three cards off sentinel. That's true. All right, coming on in. Dang it, no blocks. Yeah, my card's better than yours is. Wow, rude. I mean, um, so far, Bowmack where it stands to draw two cards. Mm, that's true. It hasn't yet drawn them though. It's theoretical cards. All right, you get to draw a card. Hell yeah. And I one take and one. one. Pass to you. Cool. That was Avison's judgment for those following along in chat. Um. I'm clearing. Take one. Uh, relic order your career. I don't like you. Am I go? Yeah. All right. March your relic order. <laughs> Coming on in it's for one. Happening. <laughs> it's oh, happening. It's happening. Fast you. Okay. Two cards on hand. Two cards. Morseful Cleric. Okay. Here you go. How many cards do you have in hand, Max? Five. Draw. Um, combat. Block. Okay. Oh. Bye bye, Bomat. Um, Flame Blade and Karizev. Yeah. Go ahead. Cool. How'd the games go with Aaron? They were good. They were good. Third game, especially, was really close. Yeah. Yogmoth is a good card, turns out. Yeah. Play the trans crown. Sure. Take one hot shot mechanic. Sure. Here you go. Draw. Right, this rotisserie was Edge online. Mage. I'll kill the hotshot. Sure. Coming on in. Make a Ragavan token. Take four? Yeah. All right. Pass to you. Cool. 
great sword. Sure. Too many equipment. Yes. Pass the turn. Yeah, this is the. I think this is a risk against a removal heavy deck. Yeah, so. all the equipment and stuff. Yeah. All right. Uh, blood Epicure, take one. Yeah. Make a blood token. Voldaren Epicure. Yeah, that one. Bleeding Epicure. All right, I'm just going to discard my Surly Badger Sword to draw a card using sure. the blood token. Trigger my Flame Blade. Combat? Yeah. Coming on in for Fun. two, five, seven. Yeah, go to one. Pass to you. All right. Well, top sign clearing for mana. Okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Boom. We got another game three. What would what, what, you do? Um, those all been little good. little stumble on mana there from Max little and stumble, uh, little a capitalization yeah. from James. <laughs> Max will be on the play this time. That is going to change the calculus a bit, I think. Anybody changing their main deck configurations? Uh, I don't think I will be. Sticking with your sideboard plan from game one, or game two rather. Yeah, I think I'm keeping mine as well. All right. While they're shuffling up, let's uh, let's take a little break here and check out the results. See if we got any other changes over here. I think I might have just shuffled in a bunch of cards the wrong way. Well, <laughs> it's gonna take a little while. Still in the early days of the uh, of the games upstairs. Yeah, no. I don't know if they've updated. I know they I, better. <laughs> they better. We've got a few reports. Okay. We have I mean, one, yeah, two, some. three, four. There's we have four matches reported. That's a reasonable number. Ooh boy. Some people are also not here, so we're not going to get like all of them. Yeah, we do have uh, one player not here. Yeah, I don't think Z here is here either. I don't think Z yeah. here is or on kit, unless he's upstairs. And, like, is Z not coming? No, Z, Z posted in the chat. They're on their way. Okay, cool. They're just not going to get here. It seems like they've got a farther drive then. Yeah. yeah that's fine. No sweat. <laughs> all right. I'm going to take it. You're good. There you go. Okay, fine. No, I feel like I've got to now. I'm going to yeah. do this. I don't know. Is this... Something? That's your Esper Sentinel we're putting right on bottom. Right on the bottom. And that's, uh, top, an, that's one... an equipment to go right on top. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Esper Sentinel versus... Uh, it's funny, historically, I think that aggro tends to be a little bit challenging in rotisserie drafts, at least in other cubes I've done, because yeah. everyone else can, like, take silver bullets against the aggro deck. Uh, I feel like, I guess I feel like aggro uh, does not get that much better in rotisserie, whereas uh, yeah, a lot I of other strategies that care a lot more about combining specific cards get a lot better. But aggro is so, like, your cards are replaceable that a lot of times a rotisserie aggro deck is kind of similar to a normal draft aggro deck. But sure. these two decks both seem really good. All right, so I'm gonna talk this so, because this is a really interesting. Oh. This is a this is a really interesting uh, keep, or or not. I think the answer is not. Um, it like I can definitely turn this on. The problem is I have this and this, so like I'm gonna be reactive, which I don't think I want to be. Um, I think I think this I think this is not supportive of a reactive plan. Um, plus, like this can get turned off, so it's like just not worth it. But it's—I think it's kind of close. I think with that's a really interesting hand. I agree. Okay. Slightly different configurations. I think I would I'm keep keeping that. my hand over to Jams. It's a little aspirational, but I think that's okay. Um, yeah, that's that's me. That's you. All right, down to six for Max on the play in this game three. Ba -ba. Got to practice my actual coverage for uh, for KubeCon this oh, year. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Are you doing more coverage? You did, I am. Yeah. You just did one one uh, thing last. I did one, two one, oh, drafts did last oh, year. Okay. I think I'll be doing more this year. They're like be a little more formal this year with their approach. So they're going to put like coverage teams together. So I'll be paired with somebody else, oh, and cool. we'll do I think at least one a day. Cool. That's TBD. But TBD. Secret information. Yeah, I was definitely able to live vicariously through people because of the coverage. Right, I, yeah, you, you weren't there. Wow. Wasn't there. Clearly a mistake to not be there. Oh, my God. All right, <laughs> so I'm going to show this off. Uh, Is it a keep? 
I'm not sure. Okay. But we've got once again. It is a. It's we're a. Not it's sure. a very much a very similar hand. Um, interesting. Interesting. Like I think if I were to keep it, I would probably have to put this to the bottom. Um, but like, the hand is also kind of bad still. Is he gonna beat me with a five card hand, chat? That would be embarrassing for you. <laughs> I thought like, hey, let's get in early. Let's take this crown. Yeah, I mean that's why I wanted to go in. I was like, you know, I got a, I got a sixty, yeah. I got a sixty percent chance to get the crown on the first go. You are going back for five. Yeah, I'm going down to five. All right. We've seen two. I can be this guy. Tell him the general shape of those hands you sent back. Do you care? Oh yeah, yeah. Go ahead. They were We've really seen two weird one hands. land hands, both with Mox Opal, that you could turn on on turn two. Yeah. Like with enough one mana artifacts that you I could. I see. I see. But but like it's a little risky. But then everything it's like four mana it's like well that's not is that ever being cast yeah. i don't know plus like if you um if you disrupt it like at all mm -hmm. it, it starts yeah, to like fall yeah, yeah. I, at I, all if you disrupt it <laughs> at all you look at it funny <laughs> um yeah i'm kind of surprised you're i mean do you think mox opal makes so i, I did the math okay, I, I genuinely okay. did the math uh it is i mean so it is i'm playing 16 lands one of which is a wasteland which is like half of a source and the mox opal um, I think the question for your deck is not can you turn it on. It's can you turn it on before you would have just played it as a yes, land drop that's, anyway. That's the real question. Because if you're turning it on on turn three or four, it would have just been another land drop. But you're not actually accelerating. You're just playing it's, a more fragile it is, land. It is very. It's not a lot better than a land, but mm -hmm. it's a little bit better than a land. Sure, sure, it's, sure. It, it is real. It's turned on by turn two and turn three. Like I can pretty. I can. Uh, I was. I think it's like. Uh, I think it's like eighty-five percent chance to have two other artifacts by turn uh, on, like on turn three. Okay. Um, two other artifacts you can cast and put in play, yes. not just draw. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, All right, the aggro deck, Max defending the crown, you're going still on down seven, to five. Right? I'm still on seven. Ooh. I've been James, on seven this whole time. James on a clean time. seven. All right, cool. So we're definitely it's keeping this. It's not the greatest seven. This is like a this is a seven that a five could punish. Oh, I'm sorry, I shouldn't be looking. Oh wow. Just looking at my cards. Yeah. All right. So. Got to give me warning. I'm just my eyes don't stop working. I know. You know. Well, you mean? <laughs> I'll just like turn. Okay. Right, so, so I'm definitely keeping this. The question is, what I put away. I think. I mean, I'm definitely putting this away because it, it it's less Oop. good. Um, I think I just put it's I it's one of these two. I think, and I think um some of the play. I think it's just this card because this doesn't always like do things. So I think I just do this and I just. Hope to do that, and there you go. Yeah, you got a you got a plan. It you is plan. Uh, try to kill James safe? before card yeah, advantage you matters. Go. You may open your eyes, James. Thank you. you ready? Yeah, let's do it. Oh, we're throwing cards everywhere. Try not to also party foul. Cards. <laughs> party foul. Party foul. All right, we'll play this planes and get some boss in here. Okay. Here you go. That is. Huh? Does that change things? Yeah, I'll I do too. My favorite is like, is this about my career? Oh, take epic one. here. Make a blood token. Pass yeah. to you. Cool. Spirit of the Labyrinth, go. Do you mind playing your cards just like forward five inches, James? Me? Is that is that yeah, distracting for you? Yeah, I can also scoot you? up. Uh, that's probably what. The yeah, mic you're, you're is, sitting pretty far back the from the table. Is, um... <laughs> if only the mic was on some sort of adjustable arm. Yeah. If only. That would be so helpful. Right. You could just Draw. put it wherever you wanted. <laughs> <laughs> That didn't feel good. <laughs> you can you can move the arm up and tilt the mic down more at your face. We're just gonna figure this out. Over I mean, the look, course. see how see how Max is set up. Yeah, I I didn't set this up. Though. I actually set the other one up just like that, but somebody moved it. I don't know. I'm trying you know, my best the, over here. You don't know. The, there's only been two people in that chair. Yeah, to my knowledge. So it's um, one of those two. Probably. All right, I'm gonna play this Arid Mesa and a Flame Blade Adept. Yeah. The stakes are high. Stakes. Yeah. The stakes are the high. The crown is up for grabs. Pass to you. You know, you're going to crack that blood? I don't have to tell you that. <laughs> uh, play a Scient Clearing. Judge, my opponent is asking. Uh, take one. Play Blades Blazer. It's pretty good. This is this was <laughs> this was the hand. Down to one card in hand over here on Max's side of the table. Yep. Pretty good. Pretty good. It makes golems have first strike? Yeah. Wow. Well, my golems. Oh, okay. 
Darn it. That'd be sick if it was old school style. Just all <laughs> golems have first strike. Uh, did you know that flame blade adept is yes. not a golem? <laughs> ah. <laughs> Learning new things. Also, not a Voldaren, Not a golem. Not a golem. Okay, would you like to go to attacks? Uh, sure. I'll move past attacks. Okay, am I go? Yeah, you go. I'm gonna go to 17. Yeah. To get a mountain. There's a uh, there's a Jacob Geller video on on the golem. It's really good. It's basically just, it's just it has nothing to do with magic at all. It's just like on the like the Jewish story of being of a golem and is. I love I love a lot of his like video essay stuff right. and it's a really Draw good one. Turn. Jackal Golem team up win. Hmm. <laughs> Two one, Jackal Golem. Take some damage. All right, we're gonna fuse wear tear, get rid Ooh. of a golem and the spirit of the labyrinth. That is Ooh, buddy. real bad for me. A two for one I, I like, against the multi five. That is yeah, rough. Particularly since I don't have very many enchantments. All right, and I think I'm just coming in with the cool. We're two. taking one. Yeah, past you. Yeah, do not like that. All right, this is actually a really good draw. No. <laughs> play this land. I, I learned the power of this card last game. I'm going to play Sword of the Realms. Okay. I'm going to equip so it to four Blade mana, Splicer. but playing it okay. as a sword instead of the big Take double one. striker. What happens when it deals combat damage? To, when Nothing. it dies, it goes back When it to dies, it goes back to my hand. Sure, sure, sure. Uh, so I will attack you for three. Does it give vigilance also? Yeah. <laughs> Take three. My yeah. go? Uh, I guess specifically with Blade Splicer, it seems pretty good. Yeah. Uh, it doesn't have double strike inherently. It only Draw. has double strike if it's equipped. It, it says gives creatures who control double strike. Oh, really? Strike. Yeah. I don't know why I thought it had double well, strike naturally. I, know. I often feel like it should, but. All right. Coming in for one menace. Uh, Yeah, sure. Okay. I'll take one. I'm going to play a Surly Badger Sword. Yeah. Past you. I'm gonna have to read that. I know it does stuff, but I have. When stuff gets discarded, bad stuff happens. Yeah, I know, to you. right? Discard a creature gets a counter. Discard a land gets a treasure. When you discard something else, fights. Okay, sure. Draw for turn. What's the power toughness on that badger sword too? It's currently a three three. 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 All right. Um, combat. Yep. Attack for three. Take three. Swing your captain. Yep. Go get a one drop. Sure. You've been drawing well. You can't yeah. can't fault the draw in this game, at least. And the problem is, I don't know which one drop to go get. Now I gotta read Surly Badger Sword. Yeah. It's got text. It does indeed have text. Okay. I'm dealing a lot of damage to myself. Yeah, Badger Sword was printed in a commander set originally, yes. It was, yes. Oh, it was a commander yeah. card. Commander card. It's the one that the dragon egg, or the cat egg lady. Mm, sure. Uh, you know, the cat egg lady. The panini lady, right? Atla panini? Something like that. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's panini. I think, I think it's time for Thraben Inspector. Or no, not that one. That's... It's like whenever... You, she makes cat tokens whenever you cycle. Oh, I thought you meant the one Jinfei. that makes uh, eggs. Hmm? No, that's that's not it. It's a Jeskai Jin... card. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm going to get Thraben Inspector, and then I'm going to take one and play Thraben Inspector. What if we played... Yeah, card trivia, but... We none, none of us knew, knew the name cards. of the card. <laughs> Pretty fun. I'm sure that's fun for a stream and for YouTube. There you go. All right, my go. My go. My go. All right. Oh, man, am I going to go to eight? Yeah, going to eight. That's a pretty good draw, though. All right, eight, seven. Ox of Agonis. Ooh, yeah. Okay. Discarding show uh a creature and a showdown on this called so sure. i'm gonna make a counter and fight something yeah so i think counter's gonna go on first and then i'm going to fight your um no i'm gonna fight that i'll sack it sure and i'll draw three cards yeah that's a spicy meat that ball pretty good all right so now I've discarded two cards, so this is now a 3-2 menace. Yep. If I draw attack, you can double block, and then I trade with everything. Right? One, two, three. This doesn't pump tap power currently? It does. I'm sorry, toughness. No, it does not okay, pump so toughness. Okay, so it's a 3-1. Yeah. All right, yeah, I'll attack for 3-2. Three. Three, yep. Um... 
double block. Uh, sure. Um, I'll put. So this is the question, right? You can do just I kill the boss. Just kill the boss. That is a legal play. How many cards do you have in hand? Zero. Okay, yeah, I'm just gonna kill the boss. Yeah, I think that's easy, personally. Um, and then I will pass the turn to you. But, you know, the Blaze Plays are having unblockable effectively is also pretty chill. Yeah, not any... Uh, actually, yeah, because I can just... If he just... Yeah, okay, actually, I forgot about that. I was like, oh, but he can block the Bur Shirley Bajor Sword. But you, just, you actively wanted to die, though. Yeah, I'm going to attack for three. It doesn't have any kind of evasion? No. I'm just going to block with the Voldar and cool. Epicure. Um, Does that have zero power? Oh, you're oh, right. Oh, it has that, one power. I see, I see. Do I still want to do that, then? Let me see my hand real quick. Yeah, I'll block with. I'll still block with the Voldar and Epicure. Okay, sure. You picked up the uh, wrong thing. All right, cool. I will then play, I'll yeah, play yeah. <laughs> Blade Splicer. I think. Get that's, a Golem. That's fine. I'll play Signal Pest. Okay. At yeah, some point, ahead. your life starts to matter a little more than Golems. Yeah. All right. So you might be at that time of the game where your Draw. life matters more than Golems. Okay. Land. Gonna go ahead and I think crack. Crack this Heath. Sunbake Canyon, you mean? Yeah. That's not what I said. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> said Heath? I, I like referring to windswept okay. Heath? It's a little confusing. Yeah. You know, it's Heath is another. It's just I wouldn't it, correct you except that people are trying to follow along, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. just from on. Heath no, is just no the name of that canyon. All right, it's the I local. Will... It's what the locals call it. Didn't even say like canopy or something, you know? <laughs> just dragging me. I got it. No, no, no. <laughs> figured it no, out. No, no, no. I'm just, I want to make sure right. that we're, you know, communicating clearly right. here. I'll discard a mountain bullet make token a treasure. and make a treasure. Uh, and draw a card. That was a good draw. I'm ready to, like, get up out of my seat, come over there and readjust that, was... that mic for you. It looks so <laughs> fucking annoying. <laughs> I mean, it is. So it's on the, me. Listen, move the arm up and tilt no, it down. No, no, it's no, so no, easy. No. Now, now it's a thing. Okay, fine. <laughs> now, now I'm doing this for you. Um, this is fucking hard. Yeah, the sword is really good. <laughs> I, I I hate to learn it. Got this. I got to remember that. I've already played a land for the turn. Yes. Okay. Well, I mean, I'm doing it, right? Ooh. Cycle, trigger, cast from madness. So yes. we're going to resolve madness first. I think I'm going to kill your blade splicer. Sure. Two damage is dealt to that. Yeah. That seems good. Um, draw a card. Er, so... Uh, you would you would get the Surly Badger Sword trigger before you sure, draw a card. So I'm fighting the Golem. Sure. And then I'll draw a card. Yeah. That was cool. It was cool. We all loved that. Except for Max. I'm sorry. It's fine. It's fine. I feel like I gotta start getting in. So the question is, so if you just equip I'm taking three, four. If I leave back a blocker, in which case he would trade, he would. This is hard. Just remember the uh, signal pest has effective flying when yeah, it attacks. Yeah, that's what I'm. Animate, equip, attack. I feel like I need. I feel like I got a pass. All right. Which is not quite what I was hoping for, but. I don't like that face. Mox symbol. Okay, sure. It's I not do that like scary. that face. Okay. Tap. Tap. Equip to Thraven Inspector. Sure. Combat. Yep. I'll block the... Sure. Inspector goes back to my hand. Yep. I will then play Thraven Inspector. You got it. Get a second clue? Yeah. I don't have a second clue. Yeah, yeah. Put Mike. some counters on that clue. Get that puzzle bustle counter out of here, please. Thank you. 
Um, I'm going to take one and just preemptively equip the third inspector. Sure. Here you go. That's... Did you just take one or... I thought, thought you were at 14. I'm so confused. Oh, well. Uh, I've I've been... I Sometimes I don't say it when I tap the silent clearing, so it's possible you missed one of those. One of that. I thought I was, oh, well. Or I, it's possible I messed up, but... This is hard. Max keeps presenting threats. It's, it's, I keep presenting the same threat. <laughs> All right. I think the, the, the answer's got to be we're, we're escaping. That's going to be Ox, so yeah. good with Badger Soar in play. Yeah, yeah. One, two, three, four. It's also only two mana, right? Five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. yeah. And I get to leave the blast from the past. Do you have to escape eight away? Yeah. That's great. Exactly. That's nuts. Yeah. That's 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 what the ox is. Okay, so this is still in my graveyard. Yep. I am casting this. Discarding. Um, it's going to enter. So I already played a land for the turn. It's going to enter the battlefield. Fortunately, it's a bunch of lands. Okay. Um, and a squeeze. So squeak. this is going to get a counter, and I'm going to get um, three, three, more three more treasures. Up to four total. Um, yeah. Just draw a fireball. It's easy. Draw a card or draw three. I'm sorry. Interesting. I'm going to flash back the blast from the past to kill your Thraven Inspector. I read that. I always forget this card has flashback. That's why it's, yeah. That's one of the reasons why it's messed up. Yeah. It is exiled now. It's back into your hand. Oh, thank you. Yeah. I already played a land for the turn, so I'm going to play a Bowmat Courier. Two treasures, so I'm going to go down to two. Um, Maul of the Skyclave on Bowmat Courier. Sure. Flying in first strike, right? Flying first strike, 3-3. Three, three. Attack for 10. No, I'm sorry. Seven. Sorry. Five, three, eight. Eight. Cool. Go to four. Go ahead. Draw. Oh, sorry. This should have a card exiled underneath yeah. it. Yeah, Badger's been. Badger was. Badger plus awesome. extremely it important be in the main this game. Deck? I think it's a little four is high. Four is a lot. But I think I've been pretty commonly citing out some of the equipment. After game one. Do you also take out the Stoneforge Missing when you do that? I did for this round. I didn't for the last round against Adam, and I think that was a mistake. Because hmm. you only have the Maul and the Eater? I have do Maul, have a third Eater, thing? and Rabbit Battery. Rabbit Battery. Sack Silent clearing. So my side, I took out... Back a clue. Sure. You got a mox. That's yeah. Okay. Three of an inspector. Get my clue. Get us on a Yep. Pass the turn. Draw. That's a good draw. 
going like that. Oh, uh, also squee trigger. Oh yeah, squee squee squee. I'm happy you got squee though. Yeah, the squee's, squee has been. All right, I'm casting card. this faithful saluting. All right. Yeah, that seems extremely I'm good. I'm pretty sure I'm dead. That's you got to be dead, right? Draw. Oh, you're definitely dead. Because I mean, squee is the one that fights. Creatures fight yeah. when you discard them. Deal. No, no, oh, just sword. discard it into madness. Yeah. 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 Oh, the crown is reclaimed, but a valiant fight on a multi five from <laughs> yeah. Max. That yeah, that was really, close. So I was really, it was interesting. I I wonder how this changes. Uh, probably not very much because I was like the with the one drop, I was like wanting to get Giver of Ruins, um, because it's just like kind of better mm -hmm. on its own. But I was like, if you just fight it, I feel really bad. But I didn't think about the fact that you probably also just want to fight the three three. Sure. Uh, oh, I, I actually I thought I was like you know you you might have you just had the blood and I'm like yeah you, you probably won't just you probably yeah. won't discard multiple things the ox has really like definitely killed me the ox bad the hair wear tear oh the really wear tear on, yeah the wear tear was dead dude I I I this think was, this I was literally my I have two enchantments in my deck so that was that was really rough sure. I am definitely impressed with the uh, the backside of Halvar there that's I know right I've never played I've never played with James this card. but crown yourself I know right it's right yeah, there. Uh, Gotta remove green from the game. That's gotta go front. Yeah, that's my favorite one, I think. Boom. But they're all really good. Nice. Oof. My head <laughs> is so much bigger than everyone else's head. That's good. Is it good? Eh. To have a giant head? Well, big brain. It means yeah. it means 